name Avery Woods, and I'm here to tell you about the spring fashion show that Miss Sadie Harding and I will be hosting at Tufts, April 10th, and I invite all of you to join us. Virginia Wilcox here. I'm outside the site of the Avery Woods First Annual Invisible Children's Fashion Extravaganza, a charity fashion show benefiting the organization of the same name. Beginning at 8 p.m., pieces designed by our fellow student jumbos will be modeled for your viewing pleasure. Tickets are just $10. I'm Virginia Wilcox, and I hope to see you here this Friday. Was that okay? Yeah, it was great. I just hope Avery used all this backstage film for something. Yeah. Are we filming? Yeah. Okay. Ladies, listen up. Today is about the clothes and only the clothes. Make the clothes look like sex because fashion is better than sex. Okay? I mean, not necessarily everything that you're wearing, but real fashion, absolutely. So go be fabulous, okay? Is there any reason why you're being particularly obnoxious today? I mean, it's nothing personal, dear. It's just business. You in the pink, you're going third, not fifth. No, I told her to go fifth so we wouldn't have two lace pieces next to each other. Except she's going in the beginning because the color palette's more cohesive that way. Avery, the third and fifth pieces are the same color. No, this is fuchsia and this is magenta. Avery, this isn't just your show. Why can't I just have this one detail my way? Because, darling, you handle the charity and I handle the fashion. That's truly where we should be, don't you think? Um, what's that supposed to mean? I think you understand. You know what? I don't understand. But I bet if you paid me $500, I'd hear you loud and fucking clear. <sighs> Sadie, let's not be children. Children? Holy fuck. Nick, stop filming. And here's Sadie Harding, the co-coordinator of the Avery Woods first annual Invisible Children Fashion Extravaganza. I don't believe her. She fucks me over with this whole Josh thing, doesn't let me do anything for the show, then calls me a charity case in front of everyone. She's such a bitch. I mean, am I right? She is such a bitch. I can't believe I was ever friends with such a manipulative little brat. Okay. <laughs> and here is Miss Woods herself. Avery, do you have anything to tell us about the fashion show thus far? Look, I'm sure it's really difficult being Sadie right now. I mean, she's in way over her head trying to make it seem like she knows more about the fashion world than I do. And I mean, I suppose she's done an adequate job with my show, but that doesn't give her the right to make an ass of herself in public. I mean, frankly, I felt sorry for the poor thing. Honey, have some class. <laughs> Sadie! Sadie, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I can't believe her, uh, but I'm fine. Well, just so you know, we're all on your side. Yeah, really. We're, like, not even gonna walk in the show. I wish I could see your face when the show crashes and burns. Guys, this is actually for a good cause. If you don't do it for her, at least do it for invisible children. I know where you're coming from, but I just can't do anything Avery's running. You know... The show might go on, but not with us. You should quit too, Sadie. You know, to show defiance. Are you serious? I couldn't give her that kind of satisfaction. We're all totally on Sadie's side. We heard the whole story of what Avery did to her, and we think she's a huge bitch. Yeah. Personally, I'm not even coming back for the show. I wouldn't work for anyone like that. Me neither. She's out of control. Avery Woods may put on a good show, but working with her just isn't worth it. And her shoes today? Like someone barfed on her fucking feet. Oh my god. Totally. So the models are trying to stage a little coup d'etat, are they? Trying to kill my show? How adorable. It's a shame they forgot who they're dealing with. Hi, Hannah. Hi, sweetie, it's Avery. Listen, I'm calling to dial in a little favor. My fashion show goes up tomorrow, and I'm having some, uh model malfunctions, so I need you to stand in. 
Oh, and Hannah, I'm not actually asking you. I'm telling you that I will see you at 6.30 tomorrow and get lots of beauty sleep because you could really use them, dear. Bye. Hello, I'm Virginia Wilcox with Tufts Jumbo Easy Access, your first source for jumbo amounts of quality news. As promised, tonight, and only tonight, the Avery Woods, a first annual Invisible Children's Fashion Extravaganza will be going up with exclusive displays of Tufts original student designs, including several by Miss Woods herself. Let's look inside and see how the show is shaping up. Hey, whose dress is this? <laughs> Who else is? It's mine. It's great. I know. Do you need something? Uh, yeah, some of the models didn't have the call time for tonight. <laughs> Can they do nothing without me? My god, they're like unfashionable tiny infants. Hey, Nick. Shh, I'm not here. You're not supposed to talk to me. <laughs> I can handle that. You look beautiful. No, I don't. I look so trampy. I mean, this dress doesn't even know what knees are. Do you see how low cut it is? Hannah, calm down. The dress is fine. I promise. Really? I'm not trashy? Thanks for the chocolates, by the way. I really appreciate it. You're not trashy. Now, head up, shoulders back, and get ready to model. Everyone's going to be looking at how revealing this is. Forget about them. Find me in the audience and I'll be looking at you. You really are too sweet, Christian. Thank you. Get ready, show starts in 10. Okay, so we're gonna have puppy hair girl, then cankles, then bug eyes, and I'll be the finale. Yeah, that sounds fine. Okay, minions, line up. It's time to be fabulous. Trevor! Hey. I, uh, I just came to wish you good luck. And I wanted you to know, uh, I was thinking about what you said earlier, and I choose you. The dresses are on, the music is set, the audience is seated, and the show must go on. So this is Virginia Wilcox signing off. Break a leg, models. Fuck! Fuck! Oh, oh my god, did she just fall? <laughs> yes, she just fell on her ass at the end of the runway. Graceful, well fucking done. Avery, she could be hurt. I need a drink. Get ready for the worst walk you've ever seen. What? I mean... I'm gonna do the show for a good cause, but I'm not making Avery look good. This is terrible. Three out of 20 girls have walked and are ready to failure. I switched them. Sadie, where the fuck is my dress? What, what do you mean? Is it not on the rack? No, I just thought I'd ask you for permission to wear it. Well, come on, I'll go help you find it. I bet Lily or Liz or one of those little tramps took it. I can't. Just keep an eye on the show. I'm gonna go upstairs and look for it, okay? Okay. Dress? Yeah, you know, to keep her out of the spotlight for once. But then the show turned out to be this complete embarrassment, and well, she should have her moment. Sadie. Listen, just edit this part out, okay? I can't have Avery thinking I did anything to help her. The show can't be a complete success. <laughs> <laughs> I thank you, but you only righted your own wrong. So you're walking? Of course. I knew it was you. One of the girls saw you put the dress back. I don't care how you found out. Break a leg. <laughs> really. You looked so hot on stage out there. Thanks, Trevor. So. Have you decided between me and Terry yet? Actually, yeah, <clears throat> I have. And 
I definitely choose you. Mm. Avery! Mm. Girl, you pulled it off. Like, some girls were better than others, but it, it worked. Of course I did, darling. So how do you feel? I'm so happy I could just 